I'm Lynn Bowie, and this is a WJZ 13 at your desk update. A national kidnapping scam now targets Maryland families. It starts with a terrifying phone call. The caller on the other end warns a loved one has been kidnapped and will be killed unless a heavy ransom is paid. Some families have reported losing up to $2,000 in this scam. Two of the most recent cases happened at Frostburg State University and the University of Maryland at College Park. Anne Arundel County Police investigate a stabbing in Annapolis that sent two people to the hospital. It happened around 10.30 last night along Annapolis Neck Road. Officers say two people were stabbed. Both of them rushed to shock trauma. Their current conditions are not known. No word yet on a suspect or a motive. Anyone with information should call police. Prince George's County Police searched for the driver involved in a deadly hit and run crash involving a cyclist. It happened around 1 yesterday morning on Kenilworth Avenue near Highway 50. Police say when they got to the scene, they found a man in the road with critical injuries and he was pronounced dead. The crash is still under investigation. Fall is officially in full swing, and that means corn mazes, pumpkin patches, all kinds of farm fun. On Sunday, Fresh Mackenzie Farm in Baldwin was packed with families, taking in the warmer temperatures and fall festivities. There was a petting zoo, horseback riding, a giant corn box, and also a special appearance by Dr. Seuss's The Cat in the Hat. WJZ 13 is always on. Tune into Eyewitness News at 4, 5, 6, and 11. For the latest on these stories and instant updates, stay right here at CBSBaltimore.com.